everybody and welcome back to my channel for another episode of the sims 4 jungle adventure With the last episode we left all pink pixels of michael jordan completed another temple exploration and now if um i'm basically going to have them test these relics that they found on the locals so if you guys remember i mentioned that in the last episode when we left off so let's get down to the nitty gritty y'all so i'm gonna have pink pixels come over here I feel so bad, you guys. These guys do not know what they're in for, okay? <laughs> but I feel so bad. So I'm going to stop talking to Michael. I'm going to have her come over here and introduce herself to one of these locals here. Oh, okay. 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 Let's have Michael Jordan dance a little sometime. But anyway, okay. Let's see what we have here. So we're going to introduce ourselves to Paula Benitez. Okay, so she's a snob, she's a foodie, and she's materialistic. So, what? Okay, I'm <laughs> wrong person. Okay. Um, let's give her a local salutation. So, if you guys noticed that little interaction that just happened, what it means is I'm pretty sure that Pink Pixels, what well, she, she, Pink Pixels has, if you can see right here, the moodlet blessing of the anxious and she has it for eight more hours. And it says from bypassing temple defenses, kids these days don't know what true joy is, but the ancients stay new joy. Pink is now experiencing a bit of that. And the reason why this uh, Paula Benitez um, local, the reason why she lit up like that is because when you come in close contact with somebody who has the blessing of the ancients, they will um, catch the um, blessing as well. And then as you can see, after she hugs Paula and then Paula hugs Paula, oh my goodness, really? <laughs> Paulo and Paula. But after she hugged Paula Jimenez, she got the blessing of the ancients too so i'm not sure if you guys um knew that i just wanted to point that out to you but anyway um let's go ahead and continue to talk to her and see what happens when we use these relics on her y'all so joke about politicians let's go ahead and uh inquire about local myths before we may send her to her doom <laughs> you never know i'm just saying I'm just saying. So anyway, you know what? Let me stop talking to this girl and go ahead and try some of these relics out on her. Um, the ones that we already have assembled. Um, oh, wow. This is death relic. So you know what? Let's go ahead and insert a crystal into this one here. Let's... Okay, so this one, they're all actually undiscovered. So let's go ahead and use this refined citrine. So we're going to put that one in there. And... So that was a death relic. This one is the Balamapala uh, relic. Do we already have one of those assembled? So yeah, we already have one of these. So actually I'm going to put this to Michael Jordan because we already have that. What is this one right here? Zaza Total death relic. So we're going to insert a crystal into this one as well. Let's do the fire opal. Did we do this one already? Yeah. We already have that one assembled. So these, wait a minute. Watcher, okay, they're two different things. So there's a Watcher Relic and it's a Death Relic. So, Watcher Relic. So yeah, we already have that one. We're gonna put that one in Michael Jordan's and we're gonna assemble this Death Relic one. Let's do some Refined Rose. So I'm kind of wondering, do the different, um, elements do different things as far as you know inserting an emerald in opposed to a crystal or a rose or something like that i guess we'll just have to find out so let me pause this just a little bit here and let me see what other relics um she has so total kalama chaos relic let's go ahead and insert a crystal let's do the refined amethyst and what is this here so she already assembled one of those what is this? Okay, watch your relic. Death relic. Death relic. Okay, one of y'all is going to have to get one of these death relics because I want to see what the hell it does. So, I'm sorry ahead of time, y'all, but I'm just sorry. You know what? Maybe we should go to the city and just try it on some of the city folks because... I think that's what I'm going to do. Let's just have them travel to the city and try it on some of the city folks because... 
I feel so bad, you guys, doing this on any of the locals. So, I mean, they can always come back, right? But I'm going to have her come over here and get this Polinus flower before she leaves. And Plasma Bat Bait. Just for our next trip back, she can go ahead and um, um, have some of these items in case this person is not here when she comes back what is big head doing um okay he's in the bar okay he's good for now okay lady so like i said you guys we're gonna go ahead and travel back to the city just to use some of these relics on some people in the city and i will be right all right back. everybody i'm back we are in san marsh you know the waterside warble and we're gonna cause some chaos y'all we are gonna start to use these relics on the people here so i figured you know what i don't want to use these with the townies if anybody we should be i mean townies the locals there in um silver dorada why not use it on those townies here in one of the main um you guys know what i'm talking about why not use it on the locals so anyway <laughs> i'm gonna have these guys go ahead and try these relics out pixels hurry up and bring your tail over here girl okay you the first one we're gonna use it on okay because he over here complaining about other people. So let's go ahead. We can't give him a Salvatore Doradium. Do Wait, where you going? Uh-uh, 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 uh-uh. What's his name? You are not getting away. You are not getting away. What is your name? Luis Alejandro Pacheco. So we're going to use this Balampalsa Death Relic on Luis. Alejandro Pacheco. Why not? Come on, Pink Pixels. Oh, you next, uh, Miss Caliente. She walk around like her pants too tight. Okay, let's see what this does. Look at him. He's standing around like his shoes don't stink. What? Do oh, okay. <laughs> it says Pink has blessed Luis Alejandro Pacheco and turned him into a skeleton. A surprise to be sure, but a welcome one. How is that such a good thing? I don't understand. I guess because you don't have to worry about your needs. That's the only thing I can think of, but um Yeah, whatever. <laughs> Okay, y'all, so y'all saw what happened. Luis Alejandro Pacheco is now a skeleton, but um, that was a Balam... Oh, my goodness gracious. Which one was that? The Balam Balam Palsa Death Relic. So, anyway, we're going to move on to the next relic here to see if we can use it on somebody else. Let's use the Tosa Kalama Death Relics. Why can't I use that on anybody? What do you mean she's already effective? No. <clears throat> um, and go over here. Where can I, where can I, why do we only have to use this on ourselves? I don't understand. What do you mean? Uh-uh. Why don't we have the option to activate it on somebody else? So let me introduce her to Eric Lewis here. Let's give him a cheerful introduction because I'm not understanding why we only have the option to activate on ourselves. I mean, I, really? This is the time you want to do that, Michael? I, you know what? At this point, I guess I say I should say I shouldn't be surprised. So as you guys see, he was blessed with the um, blessing of the ancients because she has it. And whenever she gets near someone, like I was telling you guys, they get it too. But let me see... No, I guess we could only activate this one on ourselves, the Tota Kalama Death Relic. So, I guess we're going to have to save right before we decide to use that one on ourselves, just in case we die, y'all. We ain't trying to die. But, um, Tota Kalama Chaos Relic. So, let's activate this on... We can't activate it on Eric Lewis? Let's do it on Dina Kali and say, why not? Oh, you know what? We can't activate on, on him because he has the blessings of the ancients. So that's why we can't activate it on him. So let's go over here and see. 
Okay, let's see what this does to Miss Dina Caliente. She's next on the hit list. <laughs> okay, some any, anything? Nothing? Something? Oh. Okay, so it says Pink has, cur Pink has cursed Dina Caliente to see the ghostly images of Salvadorian food. Salvadorian food. It may not be the most dangerous curse, but it's certainly distracting. Okay, so I mean, hmm. I wonder what that does. I mean, maybe she gets hungry a lot, you guys. I don't know. So let me see what else we have here. Tota, Tota Kalama, watch your relics. So let's go ahead and activate that on Miss Nina Caliente. Why not? Let's let's activate it on her. I just don't like the I don't like the way she walks. She walking like she um she stuck up. So we're just gonna go ahead and try it on her. Why are we running all the way over here? You know what? We're gonna should use a deaf one on her. Oh my goodness, seriously, we gotta run all the way over here to do this. Let me just see how far this goes. Where is this chicken head at? I don't even see her nowhere around. How are you doing this thing on her? Where is she? Okay, Pink has cursed Nina with one of the curse of the ancients. It may be best to stay away from her for a while. Okay, but where is she though? I don't see her nowhere, y'all. Do y'all see? This makes no damn sense. Okay, there she is right here. Okay, so we're gonna stay away from her, all right? We're gonna come over here. Um, Let me have her teleport here. And I'm not sure if there's something else we have in here that we can use on some of the townies. Um, I believe we tried this Watcher Relic one already. What is this one? Did we already try this one? Let's go ahead and fuse it anyway. So let's go ahead and fuse that one. And then we'll insert a crystal. Homeboy over here is still playing basketball as a skeleton, y'all. That's just crazy. <laughs> no. Okay, so... It is so easy to get confused from these damn things. I'm telling you guys. Let's go ahead and insert a crystal and see. Let's do emerald. Ancient joy has spread to Michael. It is almost as contagious as laughter or yawns. He should have been had it. You know what? Y'all play too much because as much as we've been around Michael, he should have been had it. Anyway, I mean, they, they're only trying to kiss every five seconds. Uh, What is the one we just made? Um, Let's see. What is it? No, um, it's supposed to be okay. Transmogrification. So this is the blessing of the skeletons. I guess you'll find out once you. Oh, okay, duh. Okay. So these two are the death relic. Okay, it tells you. Oh my God, D D. So we're gonna give one of these to Michael because we already have one. Um, watch your relic blessings of wealth so i guess this one right here gives you wealth so i mean we're pretty much done here figuring out what they do because it tells you so this one is undiscovered so it looks like we have to activate this one. Oh my goodness <sighs> Jeez, and i really don't want to activate this on myself y'all but it's not like i can anyway because she's already has the blessing of the ancients so <laughs> and i'm not using that as an excuse i'm just saying so this is another blessing of wealth what does this one do okay so this one is undiscovered so let's go ahead and activate this on we have another time. raj what yeah let's activate this one on raj what what are you doing girl Okay, so I guess we can't. He probably disappeared. He got lucky. So, yeah, he got lucky. He, he, he took off. Let's um do it on Sergio Romeo. Why not? Wait, see. Hopefully he's not far. He's probably in a damn bar. You know what? I should, <laughs> I should have looked at where they were before I went ahead and did that. Oh, my goodness. Who is that? He looking all hit. But anyway, oh, here's Sergio. Girl, where you going? He's right here. 
Poor Sergio. He don't know what's coming to him. Uh, you know what? They play too much. Uh-uh. You know what? If he's not cursed, I should make a special trip all the way to his house, y'all, in Windenburg to make sure he does because that was some bull crap right there. That wasn't even... That's not the move. They, they be cheating, y'all. I'm telling you. They be cheating. Anyway, let me go back in the inventory and we're going to try that again. On... Oh, I didn't mean to do that, y'all. I'm so sorry about that. Wait a minute. Is this the one? No, that's not the one. And see, they totally made me lose track of the one that we were about to use. It's so aggravating. Um, This one. Blessing of the Wealth is not that one. This one right here. So, oh, no, okay. It's not that one. We need to do that one ourselves. No, that's the food. You know what? <laughs> I'm just going to woo saw this shit out because, okay, here it is. No, that's not the one. It was another one. I know for a fact. I'm not going crazy here, y'all. I am not going crazy. Marked for death. Okay, that's what it was. Okay, it is this one right here. But what happened was um, he took off before we complete the curse. But I'm going to get him. This relic's power is too depleted right now. You know what? I guess, y'all. I guess. That was completely bull crap. <laughs> bull hockey, okay? But anyway, um, I just wanted to bring them to the city to um, kind of show you guys what the relics do as far as the curses. So, I'm going to have these guys go back on vacation to see if we can run through the temple and possibly get through the map and i'll see you guys there. okay y'all i'm back and i'm actually at the silver dorada villa this time i figured we'll go ahead and upgrade this time around so this one actually has three bedrooms if you guys haven't seen this one yet has the little living area they actually have an archaeology table in this one we really didn't need to bring ours and I actually like um, the layout of this one a lot better, you guys. The only thing I liked about the other place is that they had a little swimming hole or swimming pool um, on the outside. But I'm guessing this is the master suite right here. And then, oh, this is pretty cool. We have um, some kids rooms over here. And another room that you can put, you know, a little toddler and whatnot in here. So anyway we're gonna start the next quest to the jungle um let's see if we can clear another temple tomorrow which will be saturday morning i'm gonna go ahead and end this episode right here i hope you guys enjoyed this one if you have any questions comments be sure to leave them down below in the comment box and i'll see you guys pretty soon in the next episode be sure to like share comment and subscribe bye <laughs>